So I had figured out that the government's given about $5 trillion. Now they have more bills they're trying to pass to get more money, but let's just say for now it's $5 trillion they've pumped into the economy. Is it a small amount of money and how does it affect things? All right, ready? If you went back to the time when Jesus Christ walked on this earth, so the year zero, right? AD zero, right? A, I don't know, whatever the AD, so the year zero. And then, you know, today it's 2,000 years later, 2,022 years later. You ready for this? If you spent $6 million a day, a day, $6 million a day for the past 2,020 years, that's $5 trillion. I want you to imagine that today you woke up and you were given the task to spend $6 million. Now it'd be fun for the first day, and the second day you'd be like, oh my gosh, and the third day you'd be like, what am I supposed to do with six? I, I mean, I can only buy so many islands and yachts and jet, right? Six million a day for 2,000 years. Does that give you some perspective on how much free money they've pumped in the economy? They've caused the US dollar to go down in value significantly, so they've caused inflation, so everything costs more money. You can't fix a problem by adding more free money into an economy. You just can't do it, but they keep trying to do it over and over. I'm not trying to be political. What I am saying is it's, cause, it's causing everything to go up and be more expensive.